past three weeks. A stubborn fire in Ravenswood destroys two buildings and requires firefighters to return to the scene multiple times. And as CBS 2's Lauren Victory reports, more than half a dozen families are without a home. I've been through a fire and it always scares me if I smell smoke. Fire veteran Jan Girding rushed down her Ravenswood block this morning two times. On Polina, the smoke alarm continues to ring. Sirens had interrupted our 530 newscast as this Polina Street apartment building reignited. Four and a half hours earlier, the initial fire battle. Flames are shooting up into the sky. And it was from the porch. It sort of created a chimney-like thing. The, uh, the firefighters had to break all the windows and um, and uh, poke holes in the roof and everything. And so, yeah, it was it was pretty it was pretty intense for a while. The flames wreaked havoc on six units and spread to the recently renovated home next door. They just finished fixing it up, and I felt so bad because I know they spent a lot of time and money on that. Firefighters ultimately returned to that property three times for flare-ups. Residents made it out safely, but their belongings did not. At least eight people are without a home now. There was one fellow I recognized, and he was very upset. I did see a couple, and they're pretty shaken up. Indeed, tenants were so distraught, they declined interviews. Their only request to the public for support. Reporting in Ravenswood, I'm Lauren Victory, CBS2 News. So far, there are no reports of any injuries and no word on what caused the fire.